Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I apologize. We had a few housekeeping matters to take care of, but thank you. you have your seat. All right, your next witness. Your Honor, on behalf of defendant and counterclaimant Amber Heard, we rest. All right, thank you. All right, rebuttal evidence. Yes, uh, Your Honor, Mr. Depp calls Walter Hamada of Warner Brothers. All right, Mr. Hamada. Your Honor, just to clarify, this is by deposition, so we may need oh, that. Okay, well, okay. Well, I apologize, I should have provided notice. <laughs> That's all right. Thank you, Your Honor. If we could get the TV up. Um, what do you work for uh, Warner Brothers Entertainment Inc? Yes, I do. In what capacity? Uh, my title is president of DC based film productions for Warner Brothers. What, if anything, you did to prepare to testify for Warner Brothers as to topics two through 18? Um, I, I did not do anything to prepare for this other than my the meeting that I had with the attorneys. Did Warner Brothers have a contract with Amber Heard to perform in Aquaman 2? Yes, there, there was a, a we, had op, we had an option agreement for her for Aquaman 2. Do you know what it is? It looks like a standard contract between a, a, an actor and, and the studio. And which actor was involved in this? Which which actor was a party to this contract? Amber Heard. Uh, it's a contract for Amber Heard for the for the role of Mara in Aquaman and its sequels. Which studio contracted with uh, Amber Heard? Warner Brothers. When did you uh, come to be the president of DC? At the beginning of 2018, 2018. Mr. Hamada, was Ms. Heard ever released by Warner Brothers from the Aquaman 2 contract or the, what you call the option agreement? No. Was she released from her Aquaman 2 contract on or about February 22, 2021? Uh, no. Was Ms. Heard ever rehired for Aquaman 2 by Warner Brothers? No. Did Ms. Heard receive a pay increase for Aquaman 2? No. Why not? Uh, we, it, as a rule, <laughs> as a company, we make these, we go through a lot of trouble when we make our deals with our actors, we get option, uh, we get options on them for subsequent movies. And I think traditionally, um, prior to me joining the company, every option was renegotiated. And one of the things that we were trying to put a rein in on was not renegotiating every deal uh, with the understanding that people come in and make these deals and they have an understanding that there will be options and that there is a deal in place. And it was a big part of our philosophy that we were gonna hold people to their options moving forward. But did Warner Brothers at any point in time reduce Ms. Heard's role in Aquaman 2? The role in the film that the size of the role in the film that she has was determined in the early development of the script, which would have happened in 2018, I would say. 
So it, and from there to beyond normal development, um, the, the role sort of the character's involvement in the story was sort of what it was from the beginning. Was her role ever reduced for any reason? Um, no, I mean, again, from the early stages of the development of the script, uh, the movie was built around uh, the character of Arthur and the character of Orm, Arthur being Jason Momoa and Orm being Patrick Wilson. Um, so they were always the two co-leads of the movie. Did Warner Brothers ever plan to portray Ms. Heard as the co-lead in Aquaman 2? No, I mean, it was, it was, the movie was always pitched as a buddy comedy between uh, Jason Momoa and Patrick Wilson. Was Ms. Heard cast in Aquaman? Yes, she was. Was Ms. Heard cast in Aquaman 2? Yes, she was. Was Ms. Heard paid for her services in Aquaman 1? Yes. Was Ms. Heard paid for her services in Aquaman 2? Yes. Was her compensation for Aquaman 2 affected in any way by anything said by Johnny Depp? No. Was her compensation for Aquaman 2 affected by anything said by Adam Waldman? No. Was her compensation for Aquaman 2 affected by anything said by anybody representing Johnny Depp? No. Was there any delay in Warner Brothers exercising the option to cast Ms. Heard in Aquaman 2? Uh, yes, there was. How long a delay was there? Um, I don't know, probably weeks. What was the cause of the delay? Uh, there were conversations about potentially recasting. Who was the producer? Uh, Peter Saffron. Who was the director? Uh, James Wan. Did Warner Brothers believe that those concerns were legitimate? Uh, yeah, I mean, I had no reason not to believe the director and the producer of the movie. And you are testifying today the representative of Warner correct? Yes, I am. What, if any, creative concerns did Warner Brothers have about casting Amber Heard as Mira in Aquaman 2? It was the concerns that were brought up uh, at the wrap of the first movie, production of the first movie, which is the issue of chemistry. Did the two have chemistry? Um, you know, I think editorially they were able to, to make that relationship work in the first movie, but there was a concern that it took a lot of effort to get there. And would we be better off recasting, finding someone who had better, more natural chemistry with Jason Momoa uh, and move forward that way? Did Warner Brothers uh, take any steps affirmatively to audition other actresses for the role of Mira in Aquaman 2? No, we did not. Other than the creative concerns and concerns about chemistry you testified about, was there any other reason Warner Brothers delayed in picking up Ms. Herbert's option for Aquaman 2? No, it was, all, it was all concerns about whether she was the right bit of casting for the movie. What role, if any, did Ms. Heard's dispute with Johnny Depp have in Warner Brothers' delay picking in picking up Ms. Heard's option for Aquaman 2? There was, there was none from our end. At any point in time, was Warner Brothers considering paying Ms. Heard more money for Aquaman 2 than is set forth in the option contract you previously identified? 
No, as I said, we we were we were determined to hold our actors to their opt-in agreements. Would Warner Brothers have paid Ms. Heard more money on Aquaman 2 if it had picked up her option earlier? No. At any time from the beginning of history through today, did Warner Brothers ever release Ms. Heard from the Aquaman 2 contract? No. At any point in time from the beginning of history to today, did Warner Brothers rehire Ms. Heard for Aquaman 2? 